If you are a Lego investor or a Lego collector, right around now in December of every year, you may start to feel a little bit worried that you might miss out on some Lego sets that are about to disappear forever. That is of course because Lego sets stop getting manufactured, they retire, and when that happens, your chance to buy them may be gone. And a lot of retirement happens in December every year. So right around December every year is when the Lego investing community and the Lego collecting community start to get a little bit kind of worried that they're going to miss out on some sets. And that is what's happening right now, of course, because we are in December 2022 and some Lego sets are starting to disappear forever. If you're a Lego investor and if you bought some of these sets, that's good news for you because the value immediately starts to rise on eBay and Amazon as soon as that happens. And when the retailers run out of stock, we start to see those third party marketplace prices start to jump, which is really cool to see when you are invested in a Lego set, of course. And that is what we talk about here on this channel. This is Brickbox where we talk about Lego investing. If you're new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button if you want to learn more. So right now we are in that time of year where we're looking at sets, we're watching as they disappear for good. So if you did buy the sets, it is great to see, but if you didn't buy some of these sets and you missed out on them, or maybe you were thinking about buying these Lego sets and then they disappear out of the retailers and you start to kind of get a little bit desperate, you start to realize, okay, I'm running out of my chance to get this set. That can drive a little bit of urgency in Lego investing communities. What are some sets that we're seeing right now in December 2022 have started to disappear off of the shelves? I'm going to look at lego.com and I'm going to look at what sets are gone for good. What are the sets that they have sold out of that are unlikely to come back in stock? Maybe they will pop back in stock very, very briefly, but largely they are gone for good. What are the sets that maybe we have missed our chances of buying? Now, of course, if you keep your ear to the ground for the next month or two, you will have more chances to buy a lot of these sets because we will see retailers popping back in stock and out of stock when and people return some sets even after they've sold out even if the manufacturing has stopped on a set you could still find opportunities to buy them but they are becoming more scarce so what are some of the sets that are already starting to dry up what are some of the sets that are becoming hard to find let's jump into lego.com and have a look now this will be different on other retailers and some of the sets that are sold out on lego.com will still be available in places like walmart or target or amazon but they will also sell out soon. So if something is sold out on, on lego.com, as we look at here, it doesn't mean you can't buy them anymore right away, but it is a good indication that the time is coming to an end on some of these sets. So let's jump in and talk about this. And first up, we're gonna look at Lego architecture. So what do we see in current stock levels on Lego architecture right now? We do see some stock of a handful of different sets here with the Pyramid of Giza, with the White House, with Statue of Liberty, New York City, Taj Mahal with Paris, Singapore, all in stock. Now, none of those sets are retiring this year in 2022. So they are still in stock. Some of them are back orders like Paris here. We have London out of stock and then we have Tokyo at the bottom here is out of stock right now. Now, Tokyo is retiring this year in 2022. If we click into the Tokyo listing here on lego.com, what we're gonna see here is this sold out message right here. Now, sometimes this will say temporarily out of stock. We can often see either sold out or temporarily out of stock whenever we look at a listing on lego.com. And they kind of mean two different things. Now, officially, Lego Group has said that sold out does not mean any underlying hidden meaning of this has retired. Uh, officially, they have said that it could still come back in stock even if it says that it's sold out. But in my experience and in a lot of the community's experience with this, sold out typically only appears on a listing when it is coming towards the end of its stock, okay? So it usually only shows up when a set is retiring and when the uh, lego.com are coming to the end of their stock. So they've kind of sold out the last of the stock. It is still possible that a couple of these could come back in stock over the next couple of weeks, again, with returns, people returning them and different things. And so it doesn't mean it's definitely not gonna come back in stock at all, but it is a pretty good clue that this is definitely coming toward the end here on Tokyo. And just to show you what I mean by this, let's just look at London. So this is another set in the architecture theme that is currently not available on the lego.com website, but this one actually says 10 temporarily out of stock. 
whereas Tokyo says sold out. So we will see temporarily out of stock for sets that are not retiring that have sold out for kind of temporarily sold out and they will be getting more back in. So it will be back in stock in you know a couple of weeks or a couple of months. But Tokyo, on the other hand, they don't know if it's gonna be back in stock at all. It could be back in stock, but they don't know if it will be because it is retiring. So that is Tokyo. And what other sets do we see this happening for? So that is it for architecture. We have one architecture set that's retiring in 2022. It is Tokyo. And right now it is out of stock on lego.com. You cannot buy it. Now, I do know that you can buy it in some other retailer still today, but that may actually dry up pretty soon as well. Next up, we're gonna look at Batman. So Lego Batman, what do we see here? So we do have stock of the Tumblr. Uh, we do have stock of the Batmobile from the Batman movie. We 1989 Batwing is out of stock right now on lego.com. And before I open it up, I'm just gonna scroll down a little more. We see Penguin Chase is still in stock and the, uh, the Scarecrow Showdown Tumblr is still in stock, but it is back ordered right now. Uh, those are retiring sets. Scrolling down more, we have Batman Cowl is in stock right now. Uh, we also have the uh, the art set is in stock right now. Okay, so the classic TV series Batman Kell is not in stock. So this one is out of stock. I'm going to open this one. And classic TV series Batmobile is not in stock. With Batwing, we see that it says sold out. Now, there is a chance that this set will not come back in stock at all on lego.com. With classic TV series Batman, Batman Kell, we see the same thing, sold out. There is a chance it will not come back. And with the classic TV series Batmobile, it also says sold out right here. So all three of these sets are no longer available on lego.com. If they do come back in stock, it will be very, very short lived. They are currently sold out on lego.com and they are all retiring. Uh, Brickheads, so if we scroll down on Brickheads, we see Professors of Hogwarts is still in stock. Voldemort Nagini Bellatrix is still in stock. Roadrunner and Coyote are, is still in stock. So we still see a lot of the pet sets are still in stock. So do we see anything out of stock here? Scrolling right down in Brickheads. So here on the third page of Brickheads, we do see Demogorgon and Eleven, the Stranger Things Brickhead set currently out of stock if i open it up it does say sold out so it does not say temporarily out of stock which would hint that they are getting more it says sold out which does kind of give us a clue that uh, this could be the last that we will see of the demogorgon and 11 brickhead set so that is it for brickheads now moving on to creator expert what do we see happening in creator expert we see they have stock of bookshop they have stop stock of the uh the time machine titanic boutique hotel Col coliseum Ecto-1, Lunar Lander, these are all still in stock, including some of the botanical sets, the succulents are there, uh, Police Station Assembly Square. So they have good stock of modular buildings right here in December 2022. Friends Apartments, so keep scrolling down here to see what is not in stock right now. Um, so Santa's Visit is not in stock. Now this one is not retiring this year, so if I look at this one, it should say temporarily out of stock, which yes, it does. We go back and look at what else is here. So Adidas Original Superstars is currently out of stock. It says sold out. So this is a retiring set uh, sold out. So they may not be getting more of these back in uh, stock on lego.com. Scrolling down more, we have the Real Madrid uh, Stadium is still in stock. Barcelona is currently out of stock. So if I open this up, and this was 40% off for the longest time, they were trying to get rid of these sets, but it is now gone. It has sold out on this listing on lego.com. So this one is done. Elf Clubhouse Volkswagen T2 Camper Van. So let's check some of these sets. Uh, Old Trafford and Fiat 500. So let's have a quick look at what we see here. So Adidas is sold out. Uh, Camp Nou is sold out. Elf Clubhouse is currently sold out. So this one may be gone. There is gonna be very little chance to pick up the Elf Clubhouse going forward. Volkswagen T2 Campervan is gone. This is sold out from lego.com and um, you can still find some of these out in other stores, uh, you know, including with big discounts in places like Walmart, but on lego.com it is sold out. Same goes for Old Trafford Manchester United Stadium sold out on lego.com retiring and may not be coming back in stock at all. Fiat 500 same story sold out status right now on lego.com. So that is it for Lego Creator Expert. And let's have a look at some Harry Potter sets. So moving into Lego Harry Potter now, we have stock of Hogwarts Castle, Dumbledore Office, Professors of Hogwarts, and Voldemort Nagini Bellatrix, as we saw in the Brickheads page. We have the Hogwarts Express in stock. 
Diagon Alley is on back order here. Grimald Place is in stock. We have uh, Harry, Hermione, Ron and Hagrid in stock. So there's a lot of stock here on some of these sets for Harry Potter. We do see out of stock on the buildable Harry Potter and Hermione Granger minifigs. So I'm opening that one in another tab. Uh, we do have stock of Divination Class, the first Hogwarts moment set that we see on the list here. Scrolling down, and those Hogwarts moment sets are retiring this year. So uh, we may start to see that change soon. Attack on the Burrow is retiring, so I'm opening that one. We do have stock of Transfiguration class. Hogwarts Express is retiring, so I'm having a look at this one. Defense class is retiring, so let's have a look. That is out of stock. Hogwarts Clock Tower is out of stock here, so what will we see for that one? We do have stock of the Hogwarts Crest still. It's on back order. Fox Dumbledore's Phoenix, I'm opening that one. It is out of stock right now. We have Fluffy Encounter out of stock. Hogwarts Moments Potions class out of stock. Wizard's Chess out of stock. So it looks like the stock levels of the Harry Potter sets is really dwindling on the retiring sets here on lego.com first flying lesson also retiring in 2022 let's have a look at that one charms class let's look at this one we have a lot of retiring harry potter sets to have a quick glance at here so first up harry potter and hermione granger buildable minifigs is sold out right now may not be coming back in stock attack on the burrow is also sold out may not be coming back Hogwarts Express, the $80 version, also in sold-out status right now on lego.com in the US. Defense Class, the Hogwarts Moment set, is currently sold out. If anybody wasn't sure if these sets really were retiring, this is not full confirmation, but it is a pretty good clue because, again, if this was not retiring, usually this would say temporarily out of stock. Uh, typically, we only really see sold-out used if a set is unlikely to come back. And so uh, that's what we see here for defense class. And it did only come out in 2022. So it is a little bit, uh, you know, it was a little bit surprising to start to see this um, on retiring list this year the, to be going so quickly. Next up, we have Hogwarts Clock Tower also in sold out status on lego.com. Uh, we have Fox in sold out status on lego.com. These are all gone and they may again come back in slivers. A little bit of stock here and there, but they're unlikely to come back in stock fully. Uh, same thing for Fluffy Encounter here with sold out. Same thing for Hogwarts Moments Potions class here. Uh, same thing for Wizard's Chess in sold out status. First Flying Lesson in sold out status. And lastly for Harry Potter, we have Charms class in sold out status. So we have a ton of retiring Harry Potter sets here that are dwindling. The stock is almost gone in a lot of different retailers, but on lego.com, uh, you may have already been through your last opportunity to pick these up. There is a chance that they are no longer available from here on out on lego.com. Moving into Lego ideas now, what do we see? So we have the Home Alone set. It is not retiring this year, but let me just open this up. And yes, we do see temporarily out of stock on Home Alone. Um, that is going to be obviously in high demand this month in December 2022. We have stock of Treehouse, we have stock of Piano and Typewriter, uh, actually Typewriter on back order there. We have the Globe in stock, we have Starry Night on back order, uh, Table Football in stock. The Office is out of stock right now, Winnie the Pooh, uh, Fender Stratocaster, so Saturn V Rocket, International Space Station, boat out of stock. We have Medieval Blacksmith on back order. Seinfeld and Central Perk both retiring soon and both are out of stock right now on lego.com and then we have 123 Sesame Street also out of stock right now on lego.com so let's quickly check some of the statuses on some of these sets a uh, sold out status on the Saturn V rocket a sold out status on the International Space Station as well sold out for Seinfeld sold out for Central Perk and sold out for 123 Sesame Street. So all five of these Lego Ideas sets that are retiring this year are currently in sold out status on lego.com and they may not be coming back in stock. Moving on now real quick to Jurassic World and this one looks like there, we still have a lot of stock on lego.com. We do have stock of most of the sets that are still retiring this year. Um, so scrolling down, we see uh, this one is retiring. T-Rex and Triceratops Dinosaur Breakout is in stock. Bionics Dinosaur Boat Escape is retiring and it is still in stock. 
Dinosaur Chase is still in stock. We do have uh, Dinosaur Escape is still in stock. So this one at the bottom here, the T-Rex Fossil ex Exhibition is retiring and it is out of stock. So let's have a quick look. Actually, when I click into it, it said is, says it is available now. So that is kind of strange. It says out of stock on the button, but when I click in, you can still order it. Maybe it means that it is almost fully out of stock. So that is it for Jurassic World. Moving on now, let's have a quick look at Lego art. We have stock of a handful of different sets here. Scrolling down, what do we not have stock of? So we don't have stock of the art project or of Elvis Presley. And just opening these up real quick to check the statuses. Sold out status on art project and sold out status on Elvis. So these sets are unlikely to come back in stock fully. Uh, if you can find them in other stores, of course, those could be opportunities. Elvis Presley is still available in Barnes & Noble in the US, I believe. So if you wanted to pick it up, you could probably go to those stores. Moving on now, let's have a very quick look at Ninjago. There's a lot of sets in this theme, so I'm not going to go through everything, but I am just going to kind of scroll down. I'll actually just go straight to the stuff that is out of stock, and that will... Uh, give us the best idea of what is going on here with uh, with Ninjago. Temple of the Endless Sea, that actually retired in July of 2022. So that is not a December 2022 retiring set. Scrolling down further, same thing for Fire Dragon Attack. Final Flight of Destiny's Bounty is a retiring set in 2022, as is the Jungle Dragon. Um, so I'm going to open these up real quick. And then scrolling down further, we have Lloyd's Jungle Chopper Bike is retiring. Lloyd's Hydra Mech was already retired from July. We have Ninja Sub Speeder and Jay's Electro Mech are all retiring. So have a quick look at, he at these ones. We have Destiny's Bounty is sold out. Jungle Dragon is sold out. Uh, Lloyd's Jungle Chopper Bike is sold out. Ninja Sub Speeder is sold out and Jay's Electro Mech. These are all in sold out status, which means uh, they may not be coming back. So that is it for Ninjago. And again, I did have to go through that one quickly because it could take us an hour to have a proper detailed look at that theme. Let's look real quick at uh, Lego Speed Champions. So Speed Champions have uh, just a couple of sets retiring here. We have the McLaren Elva. Now that is on back order. So you can still order the McLaren Elva from lego.com. Uh, it is retiring at the end of December, but right now you can still get them on lego.com. Now we have the Chevrolet Corvette double pack. So if I open this one up, does this one show uh, still in stock or not? We do have a couple of the other sets that are going to be around next year, but I'm going to open up this Dodge double pack as well and have a look at that one so we have the, the chevrolet double pack is currently in sold out status now the dodge actually is still available so you can still order it so that is it for speed champions jumping into spider-man real quick and once again this is a pretty big theme but i'm just going to show a couple of sets so attack on the spider layer is currently out of stock so what do we see with that one and i'll scroll down a little bit further here and see what else do we see is out of stock in the spider-man theme here Carnage, a popular, popular Lego set that is retiring at the end of 2022, uh, is out of stock right now. Let's just check these two that we have. So Attack on Spider Lair is sold out right now and Carnage is also sold out. So the chance to buy these sets may have already passed. Carnage is exclusive to Target in the US and the Lego stores. So, uh, and I know that Target have also started to sell out of them. So uh, the chance to pick this one up may be dwindling. Jumping into Star Wars now, Lego Star Wars, what do we see here? So we have stock, obviously, of some of the big uh, UCS sets like Razor Crest, Millennium Falcon, AT-AT are all in stock here. Scrolling down, again, this is a big, big theme, so we're not going to be able to go through everything. I'm going to skip a couple of pages in here to try and find some of the out-of-stock stuff. Imperial Light Cruiser is out of stock. Uh... Armored Marauder is out of stock, so let's just check these sets. We have Scout Trooper Helmet is on back order, so that is still available to be ordered. Bad Batch Attack Shuttle is out of stock. Scrolling down a little more, what else do we see here on page 5? Darth Vader Meditation Chamber is out of stock right now. Yoda is out of stock as well. So I love Microfighter set, let's just open this one up. This is retiring as well at the end of 2022. Now, I may have missed some stuff by skipping forward to page four there because we are missing some stuff. So, Isaka is not is retiring, but still available. Um, we have a handful of helmets. We have a handful of the uh, diorama sets here. 
Boba Fett is retiring, but still available right now uh, on Lego.com. Razor Crest Microfighter is still available. Imperial Probe Droid is out of stock right now. So let's just check that one real quick. And is there any others that we are missing here in Star Wars? Um, Mandalorian Starfighter is still in stock. Mandalorian Armored, For uh, the Armors Mandalorian Forge is still in stock as well. Uh, still available that is retiring the aat is on back order so okay i think we have a pretty good number of sets here to quickly check so starting off with uh, imperial light cruiser and in fact actually there we also do have the imperial shuttle right here so let's just grab that one as well so imperial light cruiser is sold out uh probably not coming back imperial armored marauder is sold out bad batch attack shuttle is sold out Darth Vader Meditation Chamber is sold out. This uh, double pack of micro fighters is still available. So that is not sold out yet. Uh, we have the Imperial Probe Droid is still available. I think that said sold out on the other page, but still available apparently here when I click into it. Imperial Shuttle is sold out. So that is it for Star Wars. We have a handful of sets that are sold out, but there is still some retiring Star Wars sets available on lego.com that are still available to be bought now let's have a quick look at technic so lego technic what do we see in sold out status here we have the bugatti is currently out of stock porsche 911 rsr finally in out of stock status on lego.com the ford f-150 raptor is out of stock right now rescue hovercraft is out of stock here the race plane uh, telehandler so i think that is a good enough number to quickly check here for technics so the bugatti is in sold out status however the porsche 911 is temporarily out of stock now this set was supposed to retire here in 2022 in fact it was supposed to retire back in 2020 i believe and it got pushed out a couple of times this was pushed out again and is no longer scheduled to retire in 2022 so that is why we see temporarily out of stock here they are going to be getting more stock back in of the porsche 911 rsr uh, Ford F-150 Raptor is retiring. This is likely gone. This is now sold out on lego.com, not coming back, except for maybe a little trickle of stock. And on the Rescue Hovercraft, we also see sold out status here. Now, there are plenty of other themes that we could go through here, but I will stop it here. Uh, this is just a taste of what you can look at on lego.com, but it is really, really interesting to actually take the time in December every year to actually start to look at what are the sets that are disappearing for good. Check those statuses. It does give you a kind of a good feel for what sets are definitely leaving us. What are the sets that are maybe not coming back at all on lego.com now because if you have those on your target buy list then maybe you want to go to other retailers and start to buy them because this is a good indication that time is running out on some of these retiring lego sets but don't let this deter you there are still so many amazing buying opportunities out there for lego investing i am still actively buying right now there are so many deals out there to be had so let's keep up that momentum and again if you want to learn more about lego investing make sure you hit that subscribe button down below and if you enjoyed this video please also tap the like button when you're down there with that thank you so much for watching i'm shane from breakbucks.net and i will see you in the next one